Right, today, fellow YouTubers, we're going to be reviewing Bodhi Linux. Uh, first of all, you get a bear system with just an analog clock. You can better right click to open the menu. You get compositing. You get a desktop. You have a fancy one, just flying penguins falling down. And like 16 grids, 12 grids. You can make, customize it to however many you want. You get a laptop netbook. You get a tablet. You get a tiling window manager. Let's go for the com desktop. This is version 2.1. So as you can see, you get plenty of new wallpapers. Well, when I say plenty, you get a fair few. So this is what it looks like. This is based on 1204. You've got four desktops on here. You've got your desktop one, desktop two, desktop three, and desktop four. You've got your applications, you've got your accessories, you've got archive manager, leave pad terminology. Preferences, you've got the synaptic where you need to install packages and do your updates. Because all you've got is your live at file manager. Login and in internet you've got the Midori because it's a lightweight browser. This is a lightweight operating system, it's up to you to customise it however you want. Make it as bloated as you want, put whatever you want. It'll run well with old hardware. And it'll work amazingly with new hardware. You've got tons of customization options from the look, the wallpaper, the theme, the borders, transition, scaling, through the eye bar preferences, the docks on the bottom. Literally, it's a customizer's dream. Um, not many people use it because it does take a lot of setting up, and I mean a lot of setting up. So, you've got your Synaptic Package Manager, so. You want to use a Chromium browser instead of using the default one. Just show you how quick it is to install an application. This is running off the live CD, and yes, you can install applications on your live CD. And this is obviously running in virtual box. I'm not going to install the OS and actually put the guest editions because all you'll benefit from is full resolution. But if you're running this on your main OS, you will have for full resolution anyway. So yep, that'll download the Chromium browser, install the Chromium browser like you need. Um, I'd recommend this to pretty much any user, I'll give, it, give, you, give you enough time to get used to Ubuntu first and then switch over to Bode, or I can jump straight over from Windows if you really want. Does have like This version does have quite a, like, a, a Windows sort of theme with a start menu at the bottom. I like how everything, all the composite is done software, so you don't need a high-end graphics card. And this is my take on Body Linux. Just thought I'd put a new video out there, just a quick one. If you've got any suggestions, please let me know, and I'll do some videos on there. Or if you want to have any tutorials on any specific things, if I know how to do it, I'll help you out. And uh, thank you very much for watching.